The conditioning's way different. You think you're in shape, and then you get into basketball, and you are not in shape. St. Mary's senior Sam Fedorchik is one of many who made the transition from the gridiron to the hard court. In the fall, he was the Saints quarterback and a first-team All-State defensive back. He thinks the two sports complement one another. Yeah, I think being just kind of like a court general makes it a lot easier. Trying to make the right play and find the right open guy helps your vision. And then defensively, I played uh, cornerback as well, and I think it helps in man defense a lot. Helps your movement and try to keep you from fouling. B.J. Etzel is the boys' head basketball coach, and he called the plays for the football team. We have a really good relationship. You know, I've taught him three years out of my four years in math courses too. So uh, yeah, it's just been a, it's been a really fun journey together. And so we know each other really well. Uh, he he knows what to expect from me and, and me to expect from him. And um, and I just love his his energy that he brings for us. Etzel signaled the plays in from the sideline, and it was Sam's job to interpret for everybody. He could almost even anticipate the things that we were going to call and the adjustments that we were going to make, and uh, uh, it made for a really fun fall. So it's, it's been fun to take that uh, from the fall and transition into hoops this year. I had to know 11 people's positions on the field, but, I mean, it was all right. I'm normally pretty good with that memory stuff. He's also pretty good with that leadership stuff. I love Sam. Sam's a great teammate. Just brings energy, a lot of energy. Great defensively. He's an insane athlete, and he always just, like, pushes us to get better. Athletics and Fedorchik have been companions for a long time already. I started YFL, so I think that's third or fourth grade for football, and played basketball really since I can remember. Just always love sports, love competing. Sam and the Saints are off until January 5th when they head to Williston for their next WDA contest. Well, Minot is the highest ranked boys basketball team in the WDA. The Magicians are third, just ahead of Century, and they're getting the second most first place votes. North and Davies are number one and two. The Spartans are the defending champion. The Patriots are also on the list of teams receiving first place consideration. The Majets are on top of the AA girls voting. Century moves up to second place just ahead of Red River with Davies and Horace in the top five legacy also got mentioned this week. Linton HMB is in the uh, was I should say in the top 10 of the class B boys poll yesterday. Today the Lions are playing in the opening game of the annual Mandan holiday basketball tournament. They're facing the Holsteins from New Salem Elmont this afternoon. Linton HMB would break an early tie here. Cashton Massett drawing the defense kicking out to Justin Chosick in the corner. There's three of his eight points today. The Holsteins Landon Tellman ahead to Keaton Davis. This basket will draw a timeout from the Lions. Davis, by the way, led his team with 11, but from that point on, Linton HMB just exploded. Gentry Richter over to Jace Jokum as he had uh, 20 points as Linton HMB goes on to win this one by the final of 66 to 43 was the final score today. Game two just wrapped up Standing Rock over Surrey. The Warriors had a 38-point lead in the first half.